Hey everybody, Mary and the Barbarian here. We got a nice shape for you today. It is Foxy Mat Week. Yeah, Foxy Mat Week. Hashtag Foxy Mat Week. Anyways, we are using American Vintage. Um, this is a McDuff's and the Razor Company, Company collaboration. Awesome scent. I'm gonna put up the base ingredients and then the scent notes. And I'm gonna get tub loading with my new Sawdust Creations brush. Look at that. So we have used this soap before, but if you didn't know, Matt's wife was diagnosed with, hmm, I'm gonna mess up the name, but with a form of brain cancer. Um, she had a shunt put in. From what I understand, it was successful by the time I have filmed this video. I am loading this. Y'all know I'm not the best face latherer, but that's what we're doing today. Um, this is the High Mountain White, I think, that Bobby Moffat carries. And we're just trying to build it up. But you notice there, it's just not enough soap to the middle. I'm not good at face lathering. Especially with the boar. I mean, a uh, badger. Oh. Proto lather got on the underneath and it was super slick trying to get it down. Oh, there it is. All right, let's give it a try. I don't know what kind of wood that is, but it looks good. Oh yeah, we haven't shaved for quite some time. Number one reason being too much water. Look at that. Um, just haven't been feeling well, been sick, more medical things going on more than really being sick and just haven't been able to fit a shade in. I've been thinking about it for days. I want to use that Pearl Flexi. Can't wait to use it. Hope everybody's having good shaves, doing it the way they like. You know, I hate to keep mentioning CDB, but you know, he really did believe, and I think it's true, it's your shave, do it your way, enjoy it the way you want to do it. Don't push your way on other people. Because I don't feel like there's a right or a wrong way, if that makes any sense. There's the way that works for you. All right. Willie's Blades, that's what came with it, that's what we're using the first time. Now guys, I'm going to put up the specs for this right now. And it comes with the stand. Y'all see that? Nice tight fit, very heavy razor. Now if y'all look, there are some burrs from the machining, but it almost gives you a charcoal goods look. Um, this goes up to six, I got it on three and a half. I was told it's very heavy with some blade feel. So we gotta take that into consideration. That's why we're starting out on three and a half, just right above the halfway mark. I do feel blade. Now these have, they're made in India and they supposedly all have their own serial number on the base plate. You'll probably can't see it. There we go. Which that's pretty cool. I am lifting a little bit of weight off the face. Working well. A lot of weight if you like a heavy razor. Doing well on three and a half. Great scent, guys. I need to trim up the sideburns. 
hopefully get to the barber in the next week. Every time I've called, they've been booked. Hate it when it's hard to get in to get your hair cut. That's part of the reason I started shaving my head. Getting in to get your hair cut was a beach. All right. First pass looking good, guys. Man, I cracked the edge of my lips like cold, dry air out there in it. Add a little water. Soft badger brush. Not bad at all. Creating decent lathers. No David Gonzalez lathers, but decent enough. And guys, don't want sympathy. I want to get a straight razor shave in, but having issues with my neck. Um, supposed to have surgery at some point. Just can't do it right now. Bulging disc. And it hurts to tilt my head all the way back. To the point I like to tilt it back when shaving with a straight razor. But we're still going to fit one in here soon. We're gonna take off the goatee after I get a haircut. It's working. It's pretty good. If I can start. If I can pull a, shade, a razor out, put a random blade in it, first shave, blade I've never used, razor I've never used, supposedly more aggressive, and we haven't cut ourselves. Seems like a fine razor to me. There we go. There we go. All right. We will do a third pass. Why? Because we need one. We had a lot of growth. I think this would be fine. I could get away with it, but I kind of definitely want to get across the grain this way on the cheek bone and stuff like that. Yeah, I was trying to find a time that I could like stand for around 15 minutes and talk. That's kind of been torture lately. But I think we achieved it. I think I'll be able to get through this video. Talk, be fine. There's just this brown goo of water from where it drips down my handle. Because it's a very brown soap, people. It's still sticky on the bottom. Shall I say slick, not sticky, soapy. <coughs> Excuse the cough. Wow. There we get it. Guys, I don't think I would have to turn the aggression level up on this at all. Third pass is practically non-existent. Like, it doesn't need it. Y'all hear that? No feedback. It's the only place it, like, could pick anything up. I love that. It got the net complete, completely cleaned up in two passes. There was no feedback, nothing cutting on my neck on that uh, third pass. Y'all know the drill. We'll rinse up. We'll be right back. All right, guys. Great shave. We are back. 
American Vintage. I don't think there's alcohol in this. We'll find out when I put it on. There is like a little kind of sharpness right through here. Nothing bled, but there's a chance. Okay, no alcohol in the splash. That's what I thought. Awesome leathery smell, man. Really dig it. I can see why it's one of Foxy Matt's favorite scents. I really should have made it to my top 10 list. That's why top 10 lists suck, man. You go through all your soaps, and there's other soaps that are great that don't make it on there, and it's like, why you gotta narrow it down to 10? That's why I hate doing favorites. Sorry to clean it up a little. So as for this razor, guys, two-piece. That's new for me. Never used a two-piece before. Adjustable razor. Well, I've used those. Open comb. First time using a pearl. Look at that grip, though. It is sexy. I mean... $79.99 US, $80 for this thing, CNC machine brass, so it's not a zinc alloy. Comes with a stand, comes with 50 blades. Little logoing on the bottom. <laughs> I think this little razor is worth it. Has blade feel, but it, it was not a rough shave at all at three and a half. Um, but yeah, I think that's it, guys. I do like that Bobby Moffat handle. Y'all like that? I, I think this is spalted. That's why it has that look to it. And I think he did a little bit of purple dyeing on it as well. But all right, guys. I think that's it. I think we've looked at everything. Um, you know, everybody wish um, Foxy Matt and his wife, you know, thoughts, prayers, all the luck in the world. Um, going through a lot right now. If you made it this far, please consider liking the video. Subscribe to the channel. Hit that noti bell. And we will catch you next shave.